Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. Welcome, guys, to what a typical day looks like for me as a bachelor student studying in Ingolstadt, Germany. Two hours later. <laughs> After having my water in the morning, I put on a t-shirt because obviously I can't spend the whole video naked, even though, ladies, I know you'd love that. All the spaceship, now I'm a space cadet. I make my bed and then proceed to go to the bathroom to freshen up and get ready for the actual day. Round about 8 o'clock when I'm done with my morning routine, I then proceed to my desk and I work for about 4 hours. I'm currently a working student for Ionity, which is a charging infrastructure company based in Munich and I've been working there for around about 3 months now. That's my boss actually on the left. Get in the showers and let's play Avatar now. I'm thinking a light blue pair of jeans. A dusty pink t-shirt maybe a little watch how's about a chain actually okay maybe also a little ring yeah okay dope and that's what we offered for today grab my stan smiths do my little woo dance pick my fragrance for the day and i'm thinking now bleu de chanel which is the most goated fragrance on the planet i grab my bags and then it's time to head off to university i'm outie Okay, long story short, I scooted to uni. I almost died because a fly flew into my eye and then I almost crashed because I was on the scooter and I had to stop and it was like, now my ankle hurts and there's like a stain on my sock. Bloody hell. Look at how unfortunate this is. Like, I'm actually bleeding. Like, I'm actually, I checked, I'm bleeding. I'm not gonna show it to you, but I am bleeding. Anyways, long story short, welcome to the university. I need to find an empty room so I can attend a meeting. I still have work just like a little bit before uni actually starts. I don't know what they're gonna do, but like someone needs to clean these windows. I managed to find a room. There's a little app that can help you tell you which rooms are free, and then I do extra work I have. I finish that work, I do my little shmoney dance, and then I get ready to go to my lecture. So we just left the lecture because it was kind of boring. And now I'm gonna go grab some food from the cafeteria. There was a study going on for like autonomous driving vehicles going at the university and I took part and I managed to win a beer. Cheers Flo. And this is guys, this is Flo. Flo has the coolest name on the planet as you can hear. Yes. Cheers guys, see you around. Okay, basically what just happened is so whilst we were doing the whole study thing, the lecture that we were meant to be in like ended. <laughs> <laughs> Now we're gonna go back and get our bags. <laughs> After this, I'm gonna head to the gym. Pablo's gonna go and play with his meat. No. Hair <laughs> grows in the palm of your hand. What? <laughs> yeah, you hungry? Know, Hair grows where? On the palm of your hand. If you do it. So that explains. <laughs> yeah. So we ended up back in the menzo again. Obviously a five-star meal from the Menzo Labour Kiza. Like Zim. <laughs> New building and all that crap. Oh. Okay, so I usually scooter in the way. It's like the most convenient thing. You're not meant to be using your phone on a scooter and oh shit has a time. That was a long day. I'm gonna take a nap before I go to the gym because whoa, I need it. Oh. I go to what I think is probably like the best gym in Ingolstadt, um, Life Park, because it is. And there's people who would argue otherwise, but honestly, I think their opinions are wrong. <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, most of the gyms are actually pretty decent, but Life Park is, yeah, on the upper side, but it's a little bit expensive. So as a student, I think twice about it. Uh, I'd have a good deal because a friend of mine who knows the guy that owns the gym, so that works out for me. So let's pack the bag. I'd like to publicly apologize for just how dead my trim is. It's not looking good, bruv. It's not looking good. And we are going to need slides, shower gel, deodorant, sweat towel, and I got mine from Audi. It was a gift, parting gift as I was leaving my internship last semester. Check out that video. Matching shower towel. Pre-workout. I'll take my pre-workout now so that it hits by the time I'm in the gym, which is like 15 minute walk from here. This is what I use as my pre-workout, C4 pre-workout. It works wonders, or at least I think it works wonders. It might just all be in my head, but you know, you never know. I put in about six scoops. I'm joking. Just like one scoop is enough. 
Was geht ab, Leute? Are you guys ready for this gym session? Uh, what are you doing? I'm asking the Lord for strength. <laughs> Send a gym crew. I give you the gym crew. La blend la kids, la I know. La mama. La Miriam. And la Miriam, she's over there, but yeah. <laughs> maybe we'll see her later. <laughs> I like the sexy, what are the sexiest people in the gym, hold on. Take a look, take a look. Somebody, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Well done. Enjoy your water right now. Yes, <laughs> yes, I'm tired. 9 p.m. out of the gym. Nice one, Blendy. Don't be shy, girl. Go bonanza. Shake your body like a belly dancer. Hey, lady, drop it down. Just wanna see you. What are you doing? Even the walk home is actually kind of pleasant. Okay, it's not too soon. Aside from the 16 bajillion flies in summer, I walk over the bridge. And that basically sums it up. I get a little nice walk home and that is entirely what most of my days usually consist of. Thanks guys for watching. In the next video, we're going to go to my favorite cafe. If you enjoyed the video, smash that subscribe button. It's been great having you here and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers guys.